Hi, today we will learn how to build a soft gripper for a pick and place application by using our construction kit. Let's use this orange as an example. The easiest way to get started and have a broad range of applications covered is by using our engineering kit containing metal plates, adapters and of course our soft gripping fingers. We start by unpacking the kit and take out the plate that matches the shape and weight of our products and start mounting the fingers with the screws that are included in the kit. The kit also includes the pneumatic connections, some hoses and tools you need for the assembly. And of course the tubings and adapters you need for a quick start. Having some fingers attached to the metal plate we can estimate the final shape of the gripper and the angles we need in our setup. Leave a little bit of space between fingers and the object. Remember, the fingers adapt to the shape of the object and wrap gently around it. So no need for a tight fit. If you have produce of varying size, you can always vacuum spread the fingers to get a better gripper on them. When the final shape of the gripper is assembled, it's time for the fittings and hoses to connect the gripper to the air supply. This is the first part of the assembly. Ok, now to the hosing. You have to cut it to the right length and attach one piece of a hose to every adapter. Make sure they are tight in the space and when you are done connecting all the adapters you have to connect them using the fittings provided to get one connection on every side. First on one side and now to the second side just put in the hosing and now you are ready to connect them into one single strand. Cut a piece of tube and put it into the adapters provided. Now connect both tubes to one adapter that goes into the air supply and controls the fingers. Open and close the fingers a couple of times to make sure that all the connections are tight and if you hear a hissing noise please just push the hose into the adapter until you don't hear a hissing sound anymore. Ok, the gripper fits the orange. Now it's time for the right flange adapter to be attached. There are many standard robot flanges on the market. Our adapter fits most of them. If you have a robot that doesn't have a standard flange Please let us know. The robot's adapter comes with all mounting holes for all commercially available ISO flanges. So just choose the one that fits your robot and screw it in with the tools that are of course included in our kit. The adapter plate is mounted in the center of the gripper with the plate and screws which are of course also included in our kit. The assembly of our gripper is simple, just make sure that the movement of the robot is turned off for safety reasons. For best performance make sure that all tubings are evenly sized and of course shorten the distance to the air supply to make sure that fingers are fast and responding quickly. Again, especially for Delta robots and Scar robots, you have to turn off the robot's movement before you attach the gripper to the robot. A few last screws that we have to deal with as we are ready to test our gripper on the real rack. So connect the tubing and start the operation. Let's go! Hey, it seems like a perfect fit for our orange. 
and to the testing rig we go. Thank you for watching and we we'll see you in the next video. Perfect fit. For more information, please visit our website. We are happy about a quick call or an email as well.